What is going on, mortals? Mortal T here, and today we got some big, big news. Oh yes! So they have released a new Dino dossier. They did promise to release it, and we have finally got it. And as you can see, we're back on the community forums to take a look at it because it was announced uh, here. And as you can see, look what it is. So yeah, this is in the community church 99. And a reader and an arc digest. So, yeah, it, as you can tell by the picture, you can probably guess what it is. It looks really, really cute in the picture. So, we're just going to scroll down to it. So, it is the otter. They are bringing the otter into the game. Now, when they said they had a new dino dossier coming into arc, I was hoping for something a bit bigger, something a bit meatier, something that. I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting. I just I wasn't expecting such a small dino to be introduced, um, but it was. <laughs> and it is the otter. It does look very cute, and it has got some pretty cool abilities. To be perfectly honest. So obviously, otters usually float around in water, and. Like uh, that, and that is where you'll be able to find them. You'll find them on the inland in the small uh, rivers and waterways of the maps. That's where they will be hanging out, which is really, really cool. So, what are they useful for? Well, domesticated, there are few creatures which provide the companionship than the the proper name for the otter <laughs> does rather than tra traveling beside you it prefers to comfortably rest on your back providing providing insulation that's a really cool feature i did talk the other day when i was doing a how to tame video i believe it was how the one of the dinos had really good insulation but you couldn't pick it up with you and you couldn't take it anywhere it looks like this one has good insulation and you can take it with you but anyway that's off topic um once domesticated it can be told to harvest fish on demand with a specific goal in mind from the fish that it consumes The otter has a knack of foraging silica pills, really, really cool, and can even yield a slight chance of finding black pills within. Now, they are its three features. Well, four if you count. It can be carried on your back, it's good for insulation, it, it can forage for silica pills, and it also has a chance of finding. Um, black pills in the monk in the mix of silica pills which is really cool because at the present moment in time we haven't exactly got a dino that just gets black pills from a resource we usually have to kill other dinos to get these black pills but it looks like uh, when when you usually harvest silica pills that's all you get but it looks like they've introduced a dino that has a slight chance of harvesting silica uh, black pills out of the silica pill nodes which is really really cool because black pills aren't exactly the easiest resource to get you do have to kill some dangerous uh, dinos just to get them uh, even the small little lobster things that hide on the bottom of the ocean floor they do give up black pills but once one of those hits you, you are knocked out. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think it's a really cool addition. Don't get me wrong; it wasn't what I was expecting. Um, but nevertheless, it is a new dino that they added. It is new content. Um, they do plan on introducing this before the official release. So this should be coming before the official release so they have got plans to do a lot of updates during the next well during august before the official release 
comes out so to do bug fixes and everything to do with exploits and everything just to get and try and get the game ready but it did say hopefully I'm thinking about mid month close to the end of the month they might implement this if we're lucky and I mean really lucky they might introduce it a bit earlier but I doubt it I'm I'm expecting mid month uh, towards the end of August that we might get this implemented into the actual game and once it is actually uh, implemented into the game I will be doing a how to tame video on it mortal so don't worry uh, because at the moment there is absolutely no information about its diet what it eats how to tame it if it's got a kibble or anything like that at the moment there is no information about it because it's not introduced to the game so other people haven't been able to find out what it eats but I can probably guess one of the food, well, two of the foods that you probably can tame it with is going to be obviously raw prime fish meat and fish meat itself. Because it hunts the fish, it lives in the water and it eats them. So that's what my guess is. The I don't know what the kibble could possibly be, that's even if they use a kibble for this. I don't see why not, because it has got three like features and it it would surprise me if they don't bring out a kibble for this um, but we don't know what it is and that's if they implement one but anyway Moors, that is the new otter uh, dino that is coming to the game it will make a cute addition especially if it's a so cute as that picture right right there um, but yeah that is it that is the new dino that is, they are going to add so I hope you mortals <coughs> like that video and I just want to do a little teaser as well there is a lot more information that I will be posting about Ark Survival Evolve in the next couple of days there are some big big news for Ark Survival Evolve during this month and for the next couple of days I will be talking about in other videos so don't forget to click that subscribe button to keep in touch with all the updates and everything but anyone anyway, else, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to share that like button. Who's boss by punching it in the face? And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button for more uh, news on Ark. And as always, mortals, don't forget to share it with your family and your friends and around the world. But that is it. I, Immortal T, and I, out.